drives me to do art. I find it relaxing. I like doing something that has a beginning, a middle and an end. I find that with art you definitely have that and it's nice and quick. I like an immediate kind of immediate gratification for, for doing something. So um, I also like thinking that something I've done lives in someone else's house and that they like it enough that they've purchased it. And the first piece I sold was at uh, the Nudgee College Art Show and I bought the frame from Crazy Clark's. Um, the glass broke because it was cheap. I had to get it reframed and then I got a mat board cut and I, my measurements were out so it was too big. I had to go and get another mat board cut. The whole thing was a bit of a disaster but I sold it for $250 which I thought was awesome at the time. And my favourite medium is definitely chalk pastel. Um, I like it because you can use your fingers, you can, you know, it's like going back to childhood, your finger painting. Um, the colours are really vibrant, um, you can do a lot with it. Like it's just, yeah, a nice hands-on medium. I think um, my new art studio, which was my husband's tool shed, now I've converted it over, um, has actually helped me to improve my artwork. It's, I love it up here, it's so quiet when I close the door. I love my wallpaper, I love my air conditioning, TV. So it's very relaxing, I can, it's my own little space I can lock. Um, you know, my, my little boy and my husband out and, and just sort of go for it. Yeah, I think that there probably is a little bit of a nod to the past in a lot of the works that I do and I think maybe that comes from a sense that I wish I was born in a different era. I think I was I probably am maybe an old soul. I wish I was born back in, I don't know, the 19th century. I don't know why people specifically buy my art. Maybe they're drawn to the um, bright colours, um, cheerful subject matter. In terms of what feeling people get from my paintings, I'd have to ask the people looking at them um, because I think the feeling I get from them is probably very different from what someone who's not familiar with the painting from the starting sketch to the finished product would feel. Sometimes I look at them and think, God, I hate that painting, that was so frustrating. Then someone from the outside will look at it and love some aspect of it. So I, I don't know why people or what people feeling they get from it. I hope it's something that's, you know, cheerful and happy.